Do you know that it's possible that you can make tons and tons of money just doing motivational YouTube videos? But the question is, you've seen all this, you type in motivation on YouTube and you see all these great channels and the views are insane. The views are insane. It simply means that they are getting it right because one, two, not two, not three, not four, more than 100 channels doing this. And they are all creating opportunities and making tons of money with more views. So let's check out how you can also do this in this video. But then let's look at Social Blade to see are they actually making money. So we are going to pick one of these channels and uh, to search for it and to see how it's performing. We check Motivacity to see how this channel is faring. And this is the channel. Right, so you can see, according to Social Blade, that it's making like 1.8 to 29,000 estimated monthly earnings, which is way more or less than how much this channel is making, considering the amount of views. And um, if they are also selling different products, then you see that people are buying more and more. So you can also do this. You can also do this, but let's go straight to do, let me show you how to do this. There are three things. Your audio, that's the sound, your uh, uh, stock images or videos, and also your thumbnails. These are the important elements and we are going to take them one by one. First of all, people will tell you that go to Wayback Machine. All the gurus are on YouTube, keep telling us go to Wayback Machine and uh, where you get royalty free sound, like speeches from different people to use. But I've searched here, I've searched here, and uh, they'll tell you to go to audio and go to all. But I'll keep on searching, I keep on searching, but I don't get it. I actually keep on searching, but to be frank, I don't see the he head and tail of it. They say it's just what motivational videos and stuff. But then, there yeah, are a lot of ways you can still do it. If you don't know how to fi figure this one out. You can still do it. So one is that, why can't you record your own audio? So you can record your own audio. Since you want to do it long term, your voice is so, so nice. Your voice is so beautiful. The only thing is that if you have some of the known faces, it's going to work. But then you can just go to chat GPT, put in a prompt like I did. Where is the prompt? This was the prompt. Write a motivational uh, script, write a motivational script for me with title Never Give Up. No introduction because I don't know what I don't want any introduction, I don't want narrators, I don't want any time lapse. And uh, please write in English language. Then it keep, it, it's giving me, you can see it has written this for me. And it says, it, It's in the very essence of your being to strive, to reach, to dream. When the world seems against you, when all hope seems lost, then this is a great speech, like three minutes or four. Then, so you can do this. You can just get this. Use your phone to record it or download Audacity. Simple to use. Simple to use this one. Just download Audacity. And uh, you can, for Windows, for Mac, for Linux. And it's good to go. I'm telling you, it's one of the most advanced speech recording softwares for free that can find. I use that to record your voice. If you still want to do YouTube videos, like get popular speeches, just go on and type in maybe if you want to talk to uh, talk about Les Brown, do Les Brown and do audio, audio book. Les Brown audio book. So once you have Les Brown audio book, you can download it. Make sure there's no background sound, even though there are ways that you can remove the background sound and leave only the speech, his voice. Then you can cut pieces of it, short, short clips, where you, you want to use important aspect, and you uh, mix that of your own recording. But then you have content that you don't see, sleep and wake up, because sometimes you go and download uh, the free content, and uh, you are challenged because the next day the person says it's not more royalty free, and uh, the person is taking ownership of it. You don't know what can happen. 
So if you have your own recordings, which is easy, use ChatGPT to do your own voice and stuff. But then, another important aspect of the audio is the sound, background sound. It's a background music going in to give it emotions and stuff. It makes it very important. So how do you get that? You can get that through Epidemic Sound. Just go to Epidemic Sound and they are good in that. Some people say choose uh, go to the film category. You can choose any, but if you go to the drama, it's going to help you. You can get to here. Registration, subscription for a year. Then you download any one that you want. Any of this. Listen to it. See how it's going to sound. Then uh, when you feel it, just go with that. Then once you are done with the audio, then you have your audio. How can you easily get stock videos? You see that once the video is playing, there's, there's an image component that's going on. There's like there are videos that you can see inside there. You see these videos, like great videos, because it goes with the emotion and the action. So you can get them on pexels.com. You can get videos on pexels.com. Let me see. Working out. Workout. Because mostly you see that it's workout music because you see this one. You see this. Just download this, download a lot of them, download a lot of them, and you can be able to use them the way you want. Just download a lot of them, bodybuilding, workout at home, yoga, running, just get a lot of videos because you use a lot of them. Here, it's free to download. You can see this is like motivational, this is motivational, money motivation and stuff, and you are good to go. Then, now how to bring them together. Now you have your stock videos. You have your audios. How do you bring them together to make? So you can use this software, which is uh, Clipchamp. If you can use Adobe, I use Adobe personally. It's good for me. But I still use Clipchamp and other softwares. So you can use uh, any software. You can even use Canva to bring them together. So you do create video. I'm just going to do a sample. And you have your uh, recorded video, recorded audio. So let me see the, one of my recorded audios, motivational scripts. So this is one of my recorded audios. This is it. So it, it comes straight. You can uh, just bring it out straight. It's joining. Right. Then you just pull it into the system. You are good to go. You have it. Then you bring in the stock videos you've downloaded from pexels, from different places. Just bring one of them, bring them. So I'm just going to pick one and uh, we go with it. Okay, let me pick this one. So I'm going to pick this one. Make sure that they don't have sound. Some of them have, have sound. So let me see, let me, you can see, wow. So the video is taking shape. Then another thing you need to do, just bring a lot of this, add them so that you can uh, be able to enjoy and uh, create an experience now let's bring one of the sounds that i have downloaded from epidemic sound i'm going to bring one of them maybe this is one i'm just going to use it for you to see how it goes it blends with whatever it is and you can be able to go with that so now that i have this this is it i'm just bringing it down here and you can see that ready do you ever it, you feel like your dreams are too big that they are unrealistic i you am see? here to tell you so there's no wow it's good to go and you see that there's great sound but then you have to reduce the volume the sound if the sound is too loud here people may not get to listen to hear your voice so you reduce the volume and now uh, you play it you play it and see if it is to your level and the level that you think sometimes it's too loud so the rule, rule of thumb is that if it's not if the action is not too much bring it down don't make it too loud like that right you can do it then you can use here to get the captions this part get the captions of it so that whilst it is working there's caption there's write up for people to relate with that and i think basically this is what you need to do to get your video to get your sound now that you have this once you are done with this you can download it. You can download it. But now let's talk about how to get your thumbnails. People don't cover how to get your thumbnails. Your thumbnails are very important. And uh, these are some of the thumbnails I've designed. 
So you can see that if you have thumbnails like this, like this one, it gives you that edge because most of the, let me see, most of the videos, most of the YouTube channels have like peculiar, unique thumbnails, like this one, close up, close up face, thumbnails, like this and this. So if you also want to get traction, you also need to replicate what they are doing. It simply means it's working for them. So all you need to do is to know where to get images for this thumbnail. You can use Canva. I use Canva to design them like this. I designed this and it's simple. So using images simply means that you need to know how to search to get these images so that you can expand them to get the face like this one. If you don't know how to search, and there are places you can search. We have Unsplash. You can search on unsplash.com. And once you search on Unsplash, what you do is that you get uh, an image like frustrated. So I'm just going to do frustration. So frustration. So you see this type, this one, okay. You can see this one is good to be used. This one, like this, there's action. You can see this one. I can use this one. Nice. I can pull this one up to get the face and stuff. I can pull this to get the facial expression, to get the action, and now to be able to use this. You can also go back and type angry. And uh, so if you don't know, because if you don't take time, you may not be able to know how, how you are getting these images. If you don't get the images right, to be frank, you're not getting a view. I can use this one. I can use this one to create. I can also use this one. So all these action pictures are action, actionable enough for you to use. So I'm still going through. I'm still going through. I can equally use this. I just want you to know. So it's not a one size fits all. Keep searching, keep searching. Don't, get, don't give up on your searching. Because you need to search a lot to be able to get the video that you want or the image that you want to use. This is also not bad. You can give it a title and use it. This one too, Monster Mentality. You can use this one. This one too, you can equally use this. So, but you need to, this is not also bad. This one too, you can use this. This one too. So you see how long I've gone to be able to get this. If you have resources, you can get someone on Fiverr or Upwork to get to do all this for you. But then you also need to start on budget. Please don't just invest all your money and at the end of the day, things are not working. You come and say, oh, uh, YouTube guy has uh, discouraged me to do this. So I can search your green head, man. Great. So this is also not, not, not bad. So I'm going to download this. We are going to use this. And once you come, let me start it fresh. Type in YouTube, YouTube thumbnail. YouTube thumbnail. YouTube thumbnail on the search bar of Canva. With this one, we are using the free services to do. So you do YouTube thumbnail, you create blank. And the image we just downloaded, you go to here. If you don't know how to start uh, use Canva, please learn learn it well so we upload the image so you it goes to uh you are just going to upload it this way and once it comes you are going to shape in it and it's going to look nice i always want this one to be black so you change the color of this make it black like we can just get solid black color but the bl but black is not black in me right so this is okay so let's bring this image in so you see this image is going to perform magic it's going to perform magic there. Yes. I want it. That would be kid face. I want it this way. I want it this way. So you can see that it's okay. Or this way. Because you can see most of the videos that you see, they have that peculiar wicked face. And this is okay for me. So now, I cannot basically use the background there. So I have to remove the background. If you are using Canva Pro, you get to you oh, uh, just do edit, and uh, it gets takes that out for you. It's just going to take the image, uh, the background for you out for you. Let's wait for it to do. If you are not also using Canva Pro, there's still a way to remove the background. You can see that now the background is like the same. Uh, it's just like there's no background to the image. It's just the same like this. 
So you can also use BJ Remover. It's called BJ. Just type BJ Remover. And uh, it's going to remove your background for you. It's simple. It's just going for free. And you can import it into Canva. Then now that you have your this one, you put text to it. If you want to put text, you just put text and add heading and you say never. Never give up. Never give up. So you can see that it, it's looking like some professional touch of it. And you can do this and sell. And people are buying this. You can do this, list this and on Canva. And all you just do, do, do is that you create this for people. Never give up. Never. And this is not bad. But you can change this font size to see. This one is not bad. You can see this one makes it more explicit. And uh, this one is, the, you can see, you can bring it down, close, spacing of the line. Right. Just tweak it the way you want it. Change different ones. But you see this one, I need to give you some feel, dark feel. When you check on the videos, you see that there's that uh, black contrast type of like blackness. So I'm just going to give that one the, the touch. This is it. So I'm going to do edit photo. Take your time and do it. Edit photo. And I'm going to do contrast. So you can see that if I start, you see that it's going to be black. You can see that feel is coming into it. You can see that is now the feel is now okay. I think I'm good to go. Then once I have this, you can add other things. But to me, this one is okay. And now uh, you just based on where you want to place this sometimes when it is up people easily see it then you download it and once you uh, download it you are good to go you are good to go so i hope i helped you i hope you learned something this is how you can start with this from home doing it on your own self if you don't have the resources thank you for very much subscribe like share so that my small youtube channel will grow so that i'll get to do content more for you Thank you. I appreciate it.